All right, John here from Sales by Helen. We are in Haverford for another great sale, April 4th, 5th, and 6th. We're going to give you a little virtual walkthrough. Hopefully these are helpful. We'll start in the living room. As you come in, there's several um, rugs of all sizes, very nice condition and different designs. We have a stickly coffee table, leather sofa, marble top Victorian stand. It's a pretty cool design on it. A lot of lamps and lighting. There's photographs, old photographs, new photographs, watercolors, prints. We'll have details, detailed photos on the website. As you come over here, saddle bench, milking stool, our normal assortment of silver plate, china, very eclectic taste. The owner of this house had some very nice uh, international items. So you'll see a, an eclectic mix, older Asian, blue and white lamp. So we come over here. Pottery vases, some dog bookends. It's a really nice period lion doorstop. So go back here. The owl theme you'll see all over. It's a great ink stand, ink well, pen stand with owls all over it. I believe that to be cast iron and some Asian brass items. There's books. You can see books from every genre. There's novels, there's nonfiction, there's fiction, there's a lot of art books. Some more of the great iron lamps. We have really just set up. We haven't fully gone through. We haven't started pricing yet. We will start that on Monday and we'll get photos updated. Nice architectural elements. And again, part of the etchings and prints and engravings. So you go around, you see some pottery. Looks like some spelter, Hindu and Buddhist statues, some cloisonne pair of my vases, and some carved folk art. A lot of new items, uh, a lot of items that are brand new, never been opened before. You can see there's some military U.S. Army binoculars back there. And again, more of the folk art. Also several nice mirrors. So we go over here, we have an old basket, tile top table. Try to get it in focus for you. Nice tile top table and four drawer chest. I believe that's original brass it's on there too. We looked, we haven't looked in detail. Over here, Candle wick, cut glass, crystal, looks like uh, some weighted sterling candlesticks. Here's a nice mission umbrella stand or cane stand. Tile top. As we go in here, little bookcase, some of the more owls and oil lamps, office supplies. It's a very nice early 1900s photograph of Niagara Falls with a maid of the mist. And in here are some of our depression glass, some pottery. These two pieces are kind of that low bowl and that bowl is luminescent green and that's a painting on ivory, Middle Eastern painting on ivory. Over here, some more. Another Chinese. There is a chop mark on there. We'll try to get pictures on the website.
and some nice architectural tiles of varying, who knows, maybe some Moravian, some groovy. As you go in here, there's a chest underneath there. DVDs, tapes, VHS tapes, cassette tapes, some Native American baskets, and again, more books. More books and picture frames. We'll go into this back little room. Some quilts, some linens, general household and office items. Again, give you an overview of this room. I believe there's a pair of those chairs. Nice chairs. So we work our way into the kitchen. Um, before we go in there, office supplies. There's a lot of stuff in, around every corner. Clothing will get to upstairs. There is a significant amount. So into the kitchen area, you'll see four off-white chairs. We believe there's a um, drop-side table that goes with them. Another one of the, the rugs. You can see here some aluminum. You never know what you're going to find in our aluminum. Um, there's some copper. Some Chinese, some contemporary, some antique, China, even the plants go. It's a nice iron stand. Over here, it looks like some Catherine Holm lotus leaf, spongeware. There's something for everything at this sale. This was a, again, a very eclectic collector so you're going to find something for everyone at this sale baskets pottery and it's stacked up and down so over here some household stuff glassware small electronics more linens we have not emptied all of these cabinets yet there is a lot more stuff to be uncovered. Old kitchen appliances, really clean. It's enamel, old enamel cookware. You guys know that that stuff is very hot now. And again, more cooking supplies. We have run out of space. We're gonna have to set up some more tables because we are really packed in with the, with the cooking supplies, even the television. And you can see there's not an ounce of, uh, an inch of wall space available. All right, as we make our way upstairs, even going up the stairs, there's prints and figures carved figures as we go up. So once we get up, we'll head to the left first. Belts, linens, household items. We come in here, beautiful rug, and the clothing. The house is full of clothing. It's all in really nice shape. Most of it is size 8 to 12. It is all very clean and in good shape. The shoes, I believe most of the shoes were 9.5, but there are some other sizes in there, some 10s and 11s, and even some 7s and 8s. And I stopped counting at about 100 pairs of shoes and sneakers. Purses, again, of all variety. There's designer, there's vintage, there's new. It's 
It's an old shabby dresser. It's been painted blue with crystal knobs, beveled glass, oval beveled glass. On top of it, some shaker boxes. And the shoes. You always have to look around at our sales. There's a beautiful hooked rug underneath. Again, the sale is April 4th, 5th, and 6th. Thursday night from 4 to 6. Friday and Saturday from 9 to 1. Uh, sometimes we hang a little, hang a little bit later on Fridays. We'll hang out until 2. Always follow us on Twitter. We usually tweet when we leave the sale. Coming to this room again, another really excellent rug. Some luggage, trunk under there, low size trunk. Some linens. This is a really nice old chest with the mirror. And more clothes. So we have not gone to the basement yet, and we have not gone to the garage. They are both packed. I know there's a kayak. There's a lot of great planting pots. There's a lot of really nice outdoor pots. There's an old oil painting. Great gilt frame. So we'll try to get those pictures on there Thursday. The family has still not been through the house, so there's some items um, that they might take with them. Uh, again, we'll try to get a fully updated listing by Wednesday. I believe the family said by Wednesday they would be through the house and have selected the items that they are keeping. But otherwise, everything will be for sale on Thursday night. Again, this is in Haverford, Thursday, April 4th, Friday and Saturday. And again, I uh, hope to see you at the sale, salesbyhelen.com.